Wait, can I just, like... It looks like it's so close. Like, you're telling me I can't just, like, fly towards this thing, huh? It looks so close. 79 kilometers. I feel like I should be able to get to that. 78 kilometers is not a lot of kilometers for a spaceship. All right, guys. We're going to see if it'll actually let us fly or how that works. I mean, we are getting closer to it, so, I mean, like... I don't, I don't know what they're going to do about the fact that we're literally getting closer to this thing. Will it work? Who knows? Oh, you know what I could do, though? I could add a little bit of, uh, speed. It ain't much, but it's something. We're solving the real problems. Answering the real questions. I wonder if I could just, like, blow this thing up, shoot it a couple times, it just fucking explodes. Oops. Like, I really am curious what it's going to, like, do. Cause like eventually I'm gonna be like close to this fucking thing and it's gonna like need to figure shit out here. Like as far as I know this doesn't work, but like at the same time it kind of looks like it could. What do we think is gonna happen, huh? Is it gonna let me just land on this thing? Think it's just gonna like automatically take over and like land for me? Like what was gonna happen here? We are getting closer. Maybe as soon as you get close some space pirates will come out of nowhere and start attacking you. I'm sure there's gotta be somebody who's been wondering this. I don't know if anybody has, like, actually fully tested this yet. Only, like, 50 kilometers to go. It's, like, legitimately pathetic how slow these spaceships actually travel. Like, I'm almost certain that the speed is measured in, like, kilometers an hour. I feel like that's gotta be 149 kilometers an hour. We're going, like, probably about 2 kilometers a minute here. A little more than. I just, I don't understand how a spaceship could possibly be this slow. Like, this is slower than the majority of airplanes on this Earth. Like, tell me why these spaceships literally go slower than airplanes. We're almost there, only 35 kilometers to go. And this thing is certainly getting bigger. Of course I had to choose the slowest ship that I have. Like, 100% the slowest one. We're almost there. 20 kilometers, let's go. See, the last time I was gonna try this, it was like an actual planet, and it was like 4,000 kilometers away. And you know, when the planet is 4,000 kilometers away, it's pretty hard to like, justify doing this. But when it's like, literally 70 kilometers away, how could you say no? It's kind of crazy that this thing is literally 14 kilometers away from me, and it's still the size that it is. Like, small asteroid, honestly. It's getting measured in meters now. I don't know. I think it might let us do this. Maybe we'll just crash right into it. Holy shit, is that my shadow? There's no way that's my shadow. Oh, I think that's my shadow. Hmm. I don't want to open the planet map. I want to enter the planet this way. Also, it's not even a fucking planet, but you know what? Oh, I'm just gonna crash into this thing, aren't I? How's this work? I'm literally just gonna crash into it. That's stupid, bro. That's literally fucking stupid. Oh, you go through it. Oh, the game really, really did not want you to do this at all. Holy shit. You literally just go through the fucking planet. What the fuck, dude? They straight up did not account for this one bit. That's crazy. That's actually fucking crazy. I wonder if anybody's tried this yet, because... What the fuck? They... That's literally how they handle this situation. I honestly can't believe that's how they handle this situation. Just go right fucking through the thing, huh? That's it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, show the algorithm some love and hit that like button for me. Also, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already to stay up to date on all my latest gaming content. Of course, for as little as 99 cents a month, you can become a channel member and help support the channel monetarily. On that note, I'd like to give a special shout out to my active channel members. Thank you all for your continued support. It is definitely greatly appreciated. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out.